Hello guys, welcome to another new video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make this retro text animation like this on Filmora X. So let's start the video. Before we start, please subscribe to our channel for more cool tutorial. So open Filmora and import your file. I already imported my file. So as you can see, I import a fractal noise video. This video link given on the description below. So add this to the timeline. We use it as a retro background. Ok then go file and go project settings and set frame rate to 60 fps. Ok now select this background and go color correction. Then go adjust and then go color, decrease some exposure and set brightness to minus 100. Then go light, set highlights and shadows to minus 100, set whites to 100 and set blacks to minus 90 to minus 95. Let's check a preview. Adjust as you like. Then click OK. Now we can use it as a background. Now place time down bar to 5 seconds and hold control button and drag like this. So as you can see our retro background is done. But if you think the white wiggle effect is too much, then just go color correction. And set black to minus 100. So as you can see now it's perfect. Ok now go sample colors and add black color into upper track. Then go titles and add default title into upper track. Double click on this. And change font as you like. And also change size. Then edit your text here. Then go color section. And change color to some yellow white color. And click OK. Then take a snapshot of this. Then again go color section. And this time change color to black red type color. Also take a snapshot of this. Ok then delete text and black color. First add red snapshot into upper track. Then double click on this and change blending mode to screen. So as you can see our background is now visible here. Then go effects and search glow and add this to the snapshot. Then again search water. And add this to the snapshot. Then again search square blur. 
and also add this to the snapshot. Then double click on this and you go video effects. Set glow radius 10 and alpha to 60. Then set water emboss to 0 0.10. Then set step to 10 and alpha to 10. Then go square blur. Set size to 1 and alpha to 20. Ok now zoom the timeline and go 1 seconds later. And split extra part and delete this. Then add white snapshot into this. Then copy red snapshot effect and paste on white snapshot. So our effect is look like this. Ok now go transition. And add dissolve transition in between this part. Double click on this and set duration to 2 seconds. Then click OK. Then go last part and delete extra part. Then go back 1 second from the end. And split and delete this. Then copy first red snapshot and paste on last part. Then again go transition and add dissolve transition in last part. And make sure that its duration also 2 seconds. Let's check a preview. Ok now again go effects and search light matte splatter and add this to the upper track then again search glitch lines and also add to the upper track. After adding this effect, export this video. After export, add this file into Filmora. Then delete all from the timeline. And add exported video. Then go transition and add dissolve transition in first and last part. Then double click on this and set duration to 1 seconds 20 frame. And click apply to all. And you done. Render frame and check our final preview. So as you can see our effect is done. Now you can use this in your project. Ok now export our final preview. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe to our channel for more cool tutorial. And also leave a comment which effect you want on Filmora. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.